everyone, today is the third day of the... I keep wanting to say Revlon. Today is the third day for the Maybelline The Nudes palette and I came up with this smoky eye. I mostly use the black matte shadow and the gold. Um, I really love the black matte eyeshadow. It was really pigmented and it was easy to blend and the gold is nice too. It's not too bright, but it's more like a, a subtle natural gold. I'm going to match this smoky look with a dark lip. And since my lips are still really dry, I'm going to use a lip balm and a lip pencil. Okay, those are the lips. And what is the finished look? Oh, I really like this one. Let me see if this fix the hair a little bit. Oh my god, my hair's a mess. I don't know, this is a pretty great smoky eye. The gold with the black it looks really nice. And it looks really good with the dark lips. I hope you guys like this look. I really love this. This is by far my favorite look. Maybe because it's so dramatic and I love a lot of makeup and I love how it blended. It looks like a really clean, smoky eye. The black on the Stravlon palette is really, really nice. The lip liner that I used is Wet n Wild Color Icon number 711 Chestnut Maroon. It's funny because today I didn't think I was going to come up with a pretty good look, but I did. Like. I don't know, I wasn't feeling that inspired, but once I started putting the makeup on, I really liked it, and I'm really happy that I did. Can't wait what I come up with tomorrow. See you guys tomorrow. Thank you. Okay, I started with the gold, and I put it on my eyelid and my brow bone to highlight the highest points of my eye and make it pop out. And on my outer V, I put the black matte eyeshadow and I mostly put that on the very outer part. Then, with not that much eyeshadow, I put, I started shading the inner corner of my eye but mostly focusing on the very inner part. And I started blending it out. I kept on blending to make sure that it's you know, looks really clean. Then to add more depth on the inner corner, I added more black, but mostly focusing on the very inner corner. Not, I'm not, I'm not dragging that eyeshadow all the way through. I'm blending out the outer V, making sure that it looks really smooth. And to deepen it more, I put more black, and I'm gonna drag that down under my lash line and I'm going to make sure that that outer V that I created is well blended. The most important part of this eyeshadow look is blending. And to make sure that the black eyeshadow is concentrated on the outer and inner corner of the eye, not on the highest point of your crease. Now for the uh, liquid eyeliner. I was pleasantly surprised that I didn't look, you know, I did a pretty good job putting the eyeliner on video because usually it's a mess. So I'm pretty proud of myself. That's a pretty straight line. Woohoo! Okay, and I'm lining with the black eyeshadow under my lash line. And I'm blending it out and making sure that it's smoked out. For a final touch, I'm putting the shimmer white on my brow bone just to highlight. 
highlight it. And of course, mascara on the top and bottom lashes. That's it guys! I'm so sorry that my eyes was on the bottom of the screen. I don't have a view screen on my camera so I had no idea that I was filming it like that. Thank you! Bye!